What's up guys, it's Sydney and this is your 60 minute athletic agility hit workout with cones. So grab some cones or a dumbbell or a set of paper towels and let's do it. Alright guys, I hope you're ready for this 60 minute workout. It is cardio themed today and we're going to be doing some agility with the cones today. Like I said in the intro, if you don't have cones, you can use any other small object, a towel, a rolled up towel, a roll of paper towels, dumbbells, anything like that. So if you don't have cones, don't think this workout isn't for you. Just grab two things so you can place them, move them around right beside you. Okay? So we're going to get started with a quick warm up. We're going to start with jumping jacks first in two. One, let's do it. Arms and legs warmed up here. Good job. Three, two, one. Take it out to the side. Let's twist, twist. Good job. Warming up the torso. Three. Two, one, and keep it right there. We're gonna go backwards arm circles. Warming up the arms, although this is an agility workout, you could be doing a lot of footwork, a lot of light on your toe movements. We will be using your arms, okay, for all the moves. So we're gonna warm those guys up as well. Your core will always be in control. So definitely needed to warm the torso up. Let's switch directions. And I want you throughout this workout to know that I'm always going to give you modifications too. So if you're not someone who can handle high impact workouts or not a lot of hopping, that's okay. I'm still going to give you modifications. You're still going to rock it with us. All right. Cross and cross. Good job. Nice open chest here. All right, let's take a big wide stance. I want you to bend one knee, reach over, and over. Good. Good, arch it up and over so you feel the oblique stretching. You feel the lat stretching in here. Three, two, one. All right, let's bring it back to the back of your mat. I want you to arch down to your toes, come halfway up, down and up, down and up. And this one I want you engaging your glutes. So when you come up, squeeze the glutes. Two, one. All right, let's kick one foot out front, drop your heel down, bend the opposite leg, and you're gonna scoop down and switch legs. Okay, so one leg is bending, the other leg is straight. You're scooping your fingertips down towards the ground and up. We're getting the back of the leg here. So glute, hamstring mostly, but also a little glute and then a little calf as well. All right, take your hands down front. I want you to walk it out and then pedal your heels down to the ground. Okay, so I need you to warm up the foot here. Like I said, you're gonna be moving on your toes a lot. Okay, so I want your calves to be warmed up, the arches of your foot to be warmed up. And throughout the workout, I'll ask you to move your cones around, so just make sure you pay attention to the placement of your cones. All right, come on up. And I did wanna say one more thing. If you want to step this agility workout up, you can always grab your mini band. I know last time we used the mini band, you guys were excited that you were able to pull those out. So if you want to step up this agility workout a little bit more, grab your mini band. You're going to throw it up on your legs and place it right over top of your knees. Okay, just an option for you. Alrighty, so very first movement, you're going to move your objects right in about a foot away from the edge of your mat. Okay, we're going to do figure eights. Watch closely. You're gonna go behind and in front, okay? Keeping your feet moving light and quick, okay? We're gonna start together, going for 30 seconds in three, two, one, let's go. Okay, so keep the knees pumping, keep the arms pumping. 
figure eight style. There you go. It's cardio today, so the more you can give, the more you're gonna get out of it. 10 seconds. Good. Arms pumping, knees pumping. Three, two, one, rest. Now step it side to side. You've got three more rounds of that. So we're gonna do four rounds of 30 seconds per exercise so you really get it. Okay, I don't wanna to switch too often on this agility workout. So then it'll just be like a whole hour of figuring out what the heck we're doing, right? Two, one, let's go. Switch directions, go the other way this time. Whoops. So light on your feet, move the arms up, around. Good work, good work. 15 seconds. Good. Over, in front, behind, in front, behind. Two, one, good, step it out. Two down. We're starting on round three. In 10 seconds, four rounds, and then we'll get a 30 second rest. Let you grab some water, we'll grab a new exercise. Two, one, let's go. Quick feet, quick feet, quick feet. You wanna think a little bit like you're doing high knees, right? So you don't wanna just be stepping straight leg. High knees, light on your toes. There you go, the quicker you can switch directions, the better, 15 seconds. And if you're doing this with paper towels or with cloth uh, or with washcloth, anything like that, same thing applies. Two, one, rest. You got one more round. Good job. Same thing applies. You're just going around, same direction. These will always be our targets or our moving objects, okay? Last one, two, one, let's go. Sometime in the workout today, I'll ask you to pick them up and move them while we're working. Okay, they'll be moving positions. So I'm gonna keep you guys guessing on this workout. It's agility, so basically adaptability to change. Change directions, change positions. 10 seconds, don't slow down yet, come on. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. All right, and by the way, throughout the day, if you knock your cone over, just pick it right back up. Fix it, keep on moving. Okay, you've got 30 seconds rest here. Grab some water if you need it. Your next exercise, I'm gonna have you move your cones to the very ends of your mat. Okay, so second station here. All right, so this one, it's gonna be a lateral shuffle and jump. One shuffle, here, jump, here, jump. If you're modifying, step, reach, step, reach. Okay, I want you to move quick. Okay, we're gonna go together in three, two, one, let's go. Over, up, over, up. So, like I said, we're switching directions. We're going to the side and up, side, up. Good. 30 a super high hop. I'd rather you go little, get your feet back down on the ground quickly, and come right back up at it. Four, three, two, and one. Great job. Let's walk it out forwards and backwards. 15 seconds. I still want you moving. Good job. Okay, round number two. Here we go. In three, two, one, let's go. Step, jump. Make sure you're moving your arms as well. Higher calorie burn with more of the body working. Woo, 15 seconds. Let's go. Try to get all the way over there. Round number two, five, four, two, one, good. Two down. Let's walk it out. Keep it moving. And this little walk here is just for you to catch your breath. Okay, round number three. In two, one, let's do it. Over, up.
over, up, over, up. And if you're modifying, step, reach, step, reach. Okay, still doing the same thing. You move into the side, and then you're fully extending your hips. Seven, six, three, two, one. Good. Three down. Let's walk it out and breathe. Great job. Round number four. Coming at you in five seconds. Last time you'll do this, and then you're done with it for the whole day. Two, one. Let's go. Over, up. Over, up, over, up. Come on. Keep rocking for 15 with me. Up, down, over. Down, over. That's it. Seven, six, three, two, one. And rest. You're gonna keep, whew, you're gonna keep your cones there for this third exercise. You've got 30 seconds rest as of now. Great job, guys. Okay, so this one, it's gonna be, you're thinking of the four corners of your mat. You're gonna go high knees down to the opposite corner, back pedal straight back. High knees to the opposite corner, back pedal straight back, okay? So if your cones are just gonna get in the way, you can move them out of the way. Just know that you're going across the mat, back pedal, across the mat, back pedal. Two, one, let's go. High knees across, and go straight back. High knees across, straight back. Good, and back. 30 seconds here. Whoopsies. <laughs> like I said, if your stuff is in the way, Move it. <laughs> and back. Good. Cross it. And back. Four, three, two, one. And rest. Okay, let's go boxer shuffle. Stay right here. Good job. Round number two coming at you. Like I said, make sure your stuff is out of the way so you don't kick your water bottle over. Two, one, let's go. High knees across, back pedal straight back. Across. Straight back. Now that you know the move, let's speed it up. Across and back. Across and back. Good, good, good. Good, high, 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 high. Push, 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 push. Good job. Seven seconds. Almost there. And rest. Great job. Two down. Boxer, shuffle it out. Starting on number three in about seven seconds. Here we go. Four, three, two, one. High knees across. Let's go. Round three. Back, 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 back. Quick, quick, quick. Back, back, back. Good. The faster your arms move, the faster your legs will come with it. Okay? It sounds like common sense, but the quicker you move your arms, your legs will follow. Good job. Eight seconds. That's it, come on, come on. Three, two, one. Okay, boxer, shuffle it out. We got one more round. And then, we're gonna go for another exercise. We're gonna move your cones for a second. But let's finish this one out strong, okay? Four, three, two, one. Let's go. High knees across, push, push, push back. When you get there, go. Get there, go. Okay, don't waste time in transition. That's what the definition of agility is. Your ability to switch speeds quickly. Switch directions quickly, I mean. Good job. Over, over, over. Back. You've got five, four. Come on, come on, come on. Two, one, and rest. Great job. You're gonna move your cones back in just a little bit to the front edge of your mat. Okay, so you've got room on your mat to work, but they're about one foot in from the edges. Okay, 30 seconds rest. Grab some water.
Okay, so this one you've got two options as always. We've got a curtsy lunge, hop over. You're gonna be tapping a cone or a towel or a dumbbell, whatever you have when you lunge over. Okay, so demo. You're gonna lunge, tap it, lunge, tap, lunge, tap. Okay, you can either hop over or step. If you're stepping, I want you to stay low and go fast. Okay, let's go. And if you wanna move your cones wider, think you'd rather go for a wider lunge, make it your own, guys. You do it, you push yourself, and that's all we need today. Good, switch, switch, switch. You've got four, three, two, one, rest. Okay, so make sure you're actually touching those cones. And I want you to know, the hand that you're touching it with is gonna be opposite from the leg that's out front. Okay, so if you're here, dumping off to the side and falling, that's probably why. Okay, reach across your body. Woo, two, one, let's go. Round number two, cross, 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 cross. Make sure your back is flat. Okay, so you're not arching over your flat back and your butt is down. There we go. You've got five, three, two, one. All right, step it out. Breathe. This is all about your breathing here. Always evaluate, make sure. Are you going as hard as you can? Yes? Okay, let's keep rocking. If not, come on, step it up. Ready, round three, let's go. Get those feet moving quick. You're doing great. Touch, touch, touch. That's it, last 15. Touch, touch. Keep your eye on that cone. Get there. You've got seven, five, four, three, two, one. Step it out. Breathe. Whew. Good job. One more round, and then we're switching it all up again. Ah, you're doing great. Four, three, two, let's go. Tap that leg back, back, back. And if you're modifying step, step, stay low the whole time, okay? You don't have to jump. You just gotta move quick. 15 seconds. Go, go. You should feel it in your glutes, definitely in your breathing. Seven, six, and rest. Whew. Great job. We're getting through it together, guys. You're done with that one. Whew. Moving your cones back out to the very edge of your mat, okay? Okay, 30 seconds rest. Grab some water. So we just went side to side on that one. This one we're gonna go front to back, okay? Whew. So this exercise, also different levels. You're gonna be lunging front and back. So I want the foot that's farthest away from me to stay here. You're gonna touch down, lunge forward, touch down, lunge back. Okay, let's go. Touch, touch. And if you need to move closer, you can do that. Touch, touch, touch. Each round, you're gonna switch legs. Great job, you've got seven, six, five, three, two, one, rest. Okay, turn around the other way. When you lunge forward, by the way, you can definitely reach your opposite arm across. Okay, so if you're here, lunging with this leg, you can reach over with that hand, okay? Woo, let's come back up, round two, ready? Let's go, foot in the middle, lunge, whoops, wrong way, lunge, lunge. Great job. Lunge, and lunge. Lunge, and keep pushing with that leg. Down. 
down. We've got four, three, two, one, rest. Whew, okay, flip it back around, round number three. So your other leg is moving forwards and backwards. Whew. Stationary foot is right in the middle of your two cones. Round three, let's do it. Reach across and back, across, back. Like I said, it's okay if you stumble. I do it all the time. You just gotta keep going. If you guys are regular to the channel, you know that I stumble. Woo. We all do at times, right? What matters is that you come back in, keep rocking. Three, two, one, rest. Okay, one more round through that one, guys. Oh, big deep breath, flip it around to the other direction. Foot is right in the middle. Five seconds. Pour in like sweat, pour in with sweat like me. Yes, two, one, let's go. Stumble and I can't talk sometimes. The two things you've learned about me today, if you're new to the channel. Good job, keep your balance. Nice tight abs. There we go. Already you have control, then be fast and out of control. Okay, here we go. Four, three, two, one, and rest. Whew. Big deep breath, guys. Great job. You're gonna keep your cones here at the edges of your mat. Whew. Great job, 30 seconds rest. Grab some water. Okay, so we did the front to back just now, right? That's moving in the sagittal plane, by the way. So if you think of a line that splits you right down the middle, if your body moves on that plane or on that line, that's you moving in sagittal plane motion, okay? Now we're going side to side again. We're gonna go high knees, whoo, left to right. Let's go, when you get to the end, I want a little twist, boom, boom. High knees, boom, boom. If you're modifying step, Twist, step, twist, okay? Good job, five, four, three, two, one, rest. Okay, so like I was saying, just a little knowledge bomb in our rest here. Line splits you down the middle. Sagittal plane, if you move front to back, you're moving in the sagittal plane. If you have a line that splits you front to back, you're moving side to side across that plane, you're moving in the frontal plane, okay? Let's go, round two. Just something else to think about or focus on besides the fact that you're so out of breath right now, like me. One, two, three, four, twist, twist. That's it. Seven, six, four, three, two, one, rest. Last knowledge bomb I'll drop today for a little bit. One more plane of motion. You have a line that splits you at the waist, top half and bottom half, and you're moving with your hips this way across that plane. That's the transverse plane, just so you know, okay? Let's go, round three. Boom, boom. So you had frontal plane, sagittal plane and transverse plane. And if you're wondering kind of where I get the programming for this channel, I try to keep you moving in lots of different planes of motion. Keep rocking, come on. So there will be a quiz at the end of this workout. Just kidding, rest, just kidding. Okay, keep it moving. And you're resting. <sighs> We've got four, three, two, one. Last one, let's go. 30 seconds here. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. High knees, high knees, twist the hips. Like a snowboarder or a skateboarder, right? Using your obliques, your side abs to pull you side to side. Good, seven. Six, five, four, three, 
three, two, one, and rest. Okay, leave your cones, actually no, move your cones here closer into the middle, okay? So you've got room here, feet are hip width apart, they're a couple inches away from your feet, okay? Now grab some water. The next one, you've got two levels again. As always, I promised you at the beginning I would give you modifications. If you needed them, this one is one of those times where you can take it if you need it. Okay, we've got hop or step overs. Okay, you're gonna start in the middle. Hop over, hop over, hop over. If you're not ready for that, step, step, and I want your knees coming up to hip height. Okay, so don't just step around them. You're up, up. Okay, two, one, let's go. Soft landing, if you're jumping. Use your arms as well, and I don't want you going over the back of the cone, right? Not back here, over top, or the paper towel roll, or the dumbbell. Whatever you're jumping over, or stepping over, get over the very top. Four, three, two, one, rest. Okay, let's step it out, side to side. One down, three to go. Whew. Keep you moving here. Five seconds. Two, one, let's go. Hop, land soft, land soft. Use the arms, help you get up. You're stepping, step, step, high knees, right? 10 seconds, come on. Keep hopping, four, three, rest. Good job. Walk it out. Two down, starting on number three here. This will probably be the toughest one, okay? Good work. Two, one, let's go. Over, over. Good job. 15 seconds. Ten, nine. Woo. Come on, five, two, one, rest. Okay, whoops, one more round. Stepping or hopping over, this is it. Okay, you're done with this one after this fourth round. Again, you need to modify, you're stepping over top, remember? Ready, let's go, step if you need to. Like I said at the beginning, don't push yourself to a limit where you think you might injure yourself. Okay, go to your level, that's max effort for you. Good job. Whew. You got 20 seconds. You can do this, come on. 15, I'm right here with you. Let's go. 10. Five seconds, go. Four, three, two, one, rest. Okay, big deep breath. Whew. Leave your cones right where they are, actually. That'll be perfect. Okay, 30 seconds rest, grab some water. Next one, you're slowing it down a little. All right, this one we're moving forwards and backwards. Pop quiz, what plane of motion is that? Forwards and backwards. Cutting it right down the middle, sagittal, okay? Whew, big deep breath. You're gonna go jumping jacks in and out. Okay, so your jumping jacks, your feet are outside the cone, and then they're inside the middle, out, in. Okay, two, one, let's go. Out, in, out, in. Use your arms as well, and you'll have to push a little on the way back. Push, push. Once you get it, take your arms overhead, push, push. Good job, you've got five, 
two, one, rest. Okay, big deep breath. Whew. Good job. We're going back in eight seconds. Let's start up at the top. So you can start pushing back. Okay, three, two, one. Feet together in front of the cone. Jump outside, inside, outside, inside. In, out, in, out, in. Good job, 10, nine, four, three, two, one, rest. Okay, let's do boxer shuffle. We'll stay moving here. All right, some kind of light cardio. Keep you moving. You're doing great, guys. Let's go in three, two, big deep breath, and go. Light on your feet, push on the way back. Good job, 15 seconds. Out, in, out, in. That's it, seven. Whoopsies, keep moving. And rest, great job. One more time through. Like I said at the beginning, you knock it over, fix it, keep going. No big deal. Here we go, last round in four, three, two, one, let's go. Out, in, out, in. Middle, outside, behind. Front, out, middle, back. Great job. 15 seconds. Woo. We got it, come on. 10, 9, 5, 4, last one, 3, 2, 1, rest. 30 seconds rest. Big deep breath. Okay, this one, you're gonna take both objects, both cones, both towels, both dumbbells, whatever you have, at the front end of your mat. Okay, this is a cone relay, so you're gonna hop up, grab one cone, hop back, Put it down, looks like this. One, two, one, two. Go back and grab the other one. Put it down, same thing. And then you're gonna grab the cones. Take them back up, okay? Cone relay, let's go in three, two, one. Two hops, one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Go back up, grab it on the way back. Whew. Just keep moving those cones. Cross your mat. Good job. Seven seconds. Keep the feet together. Two, one, rest. Whew. Okay, high knees. Let's march it out. I know your calves might be on fire from all the hopping on your toes, right? Let's march it out. We're going again in three, two, one. Let's go. Take it with you. One, two. One, two, grab the other one. Okay, go back and grab them. If you're modifying, step, 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 step. Okay, tiny hops. There we go. Seven seconds. That's it, and rest. Ah, calves are burning. Yes, I know. Me too. Let's march it out. Relax your foot when you march. There you go. Round number three. Two, one. Here we go. Up, up. Grab it. Just keep moving it. One, two. One, two. Good job. 12 seconds, keep moving those cones, Whoop, front to back. That's it, four, three, two, one, rest. Ah, calves are on fire, <laughs> yowchies. Okay, one more time through. I'll let you stay here, big deep breath. Four, three, two, grab 
Grab the cone beside you and go. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. Good job. Let's keep moving them from front to back. That's it. 10 seconds. Two, one, and rest. Woo. Good job. All righty. This one, you're going up to the opposite front ends of your mat. Okay, so move your cones widest point on the mat. 30 seconds rest. All right, so we're moving side to side on this one. Remember what plane of motion that is? Cut your body in half. You've got frontal, frontal plane of motion. Front and back portions moving this way, moving in a frontal plane. Motion is ski hops. Okay, you're going over, grab a cone, hop over, place it down. Hop over, go grab it again. Okay, come with me. Two, one, let's go. So you're just moving them across the mat, front to back, or left to right, I should say. We're going front to back. Now we're moving side to side. Modify, step, 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 step. Okay, always room to modify. Rest, sorry, five extra seconds there. Don't hurt me, okay? Okay, going back again. Round number two, in three, two, one. Grab a cone, move it over. One, two, one, two, grab it, move it. One, two, one, two. Good job, 15 seconds. Five. Rest. Whew, good job, 15 seconds. Good work. Calves are burning. Mine too. You need to slow it down. You can always step, step. Two, one, let's go. So if you need it, step, step. Okay, that's an option for you. Just keep moving those cones. Or you can step, step. Okay, whatever gets you there, keep going with me. You've got 12 seconds. Moving in this frontal plane, right? Four, three, two, one, rest. We've got one more round of that one. <sighs> Big deep breath. That's it. Five, four. Let's start down here this time. Grab your cone. Two, one, let's go. One, two, place it down. Back over. Good, down. Over, over, step or hop. Whew. 15 seconds. Good, keep switching directions, quick. 10 seconds. That's it, three, two, one. Okay, rest. Great job, guys. Whew. 30 seconds rest. Towel off if you need it, grab some water. We're doing great. Oh, big deep breath. Okay, we're taking one leg at a time on this one. Okay. This one, you're not gonna move the cones, you're just gonna touch them. Okay, so bringing it down with your left leg, one leg at a time. You're gonna go here, here, touch. Right leg on the way back, here, here, touch. Okay, actually, let's keep it all one leg just to keep it simple, okay? Two, one, let's go. Left, left, touch. Left, left, touch. Okay, lots of balance here as you move in different directions. 
Place your foot down if you need it. Also step, step if you need that option. Okay, modify if you need to. Good job, five, four, two, one, rest. Whew. All right, great job. So keeping it on this left foot all four rounds. This time we're gonna go side to side. Left foot, okay? Three, two, one. Let's go left foot only. One, two, touch. One, two, touch. Lots of core control here, right? Touch. And if you need to tap that foot down when you bend, that's okay. You can do it. Use it if you need it. I need it too. 15 seconds. Hop, hop. Good job. Five, four, two, one. All right, rest. So we're going back, front to back, okay? Front to the left, back to the left. Ooh, yes, I know. I'm right there with you. Here we go, three, two, one. Let's go, left leg. Boom, boom, touch it. Abs tight, bend and control. There we go. Take your time here. I'd rather you go with control than go out of control. Great job, you've got seven seconds. Two, one, rest. Whew, okay, one last round on this left leg. And then we're gonna switch it to right leg. Okay, we're back to the laterals. So you did left front, left side, left front. Now we're doing left side. One last round on the left leg. Ready? Let's go. Focus. Great job. 10 seconds. Remember, if you're stepping, step, balance. Step, balance, okay? Three, two, one, and rest. Ah, good job. Big deep breath. We're going over to the right leg next. And then we're done with single leg stuff, okay? So remember, if you need a modification, take it. Step, step, balance when you go down to touch, okay? I want the touch to be a one leg touch. Okay, so if you need to step it out, that's fine. Make sure you touch with one foot so you're working on your balance and your coordination after you're moving quickly. Okay, 10 seconds. Moving over to the right leg or the left leg, whichever leg you did not start with. Doesn't matter. Let's go to that leg. Here we go. Two, one, 30 seconds. Right, right, touch. With control. Almost there. Five seconds. And rest. Whew, great job. I'll let you just walk it out for this one. So you're moving over to the lateral right leg or whichever leg didn't already do movement, okay? Okay, two, one, lift the left leg up, and let's go. To the side, stop, control, down. Control, down. I'm better on my left leg than my right leg. I know you guys can probably tell your stronger leg as well, right? Everyone has a stronger leg, or one that they're more dominated with, more coordinated with. Five seconds. Two, one, rest. Okay. Whew, walk it out. So we're going back to the front. Whoops. That's the second time I've done that. Sorry. Five seconds. Front to back. Three, two, one. Let's go. One leg. Control the touch. Good job. 
Two, one, and rest. Okay, one more round through. You're moving side to side. Whew. Big deep breath. Five seconds. Here we go. In three, two, one. Side to side. Let's do it. Touch. Touch. Keep your balance. There you go. 15 seconds. Almost there. You've got 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Okay. Walk it out. You're resting for 30. Whew. Big deep breath, guys. All right. So I want one cone at the very end of your mat and one cone a foot away from the end, okay? Your starting point's gonna be back against this cone here, okay? In 15 seconds, you're gonna hop up, side, side, back to the middle, and back. Modification, step, side, side, step back, okay? So going forward, left, right, back. If you're jumping, hop in all directions. If you're stepping, stay low, tap, tap, Step back. Ready? Let's go. Jump up, side to side, and back. And back. Up, side, side, and back. Now when you go back, I want you to really push to get back to your starting point. Good job. Rest. Okay, 30 seconds at a time. Breathe. This one's a little less pressure on that single leg, right? So when you get up there, let's hop to the other direction first this time. Okay, so if you went up, right, left, now let's go up, left, right. Ready? Let's go. Left, right, and back. Like I said, if you're stepping, step, left, right, and back. Good job. 10 seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Okay, walk it out. Good job, big deep breath. We're going again in seven. Whew. We got it, guys. Three, two, one, let's go. Up, other direction first. I want you moving quickly, so don't stay in one spot too long. Up, side, side, and back. Great job, 10 seconds. Great job, four, three, two, one, rest. Okay, so now we're going back, hop front, other direction, and then back. Oh, big deep breath. I know this one's tough. We can do it, okay? Getting our cardio in, in a multi-directional way. Ready? Let's go. Round four. Up, side, side, and back. And you'll find that you're gonna use your core a lot more in these agility movements than maybe like a regular running in place or sprinting kind of deal although you'll still use it there. But just a little more when you have to control moving your body in different planes of motion the whole time. Good job. Rest. Okay, grab some water. Move your cones in. Both of them are about a foot in from the edge of the mat, okay? We've got two exercises left, guys, and you are doing amazing. I know this one's not easy. Now that we're done with the single leg hops, it's all downhill from here, right? Those things burn so easily. Okay. So, nine seconds. You're gonna move lateral quick feet 
hop over each cone. Looks like this. One, two, three, step, step. One, two, three, step, step. Okay, move that a little bit more. Okay, let's go. One, two, three, step, step. One, two, three, step, step. One, two, three, step, step. So you're tapping both feet on the outside. Come back into the middle. One, two, three, step, step. Four, three, two, one, rest. Okay, side to side, one round down. Quick feet in the middle, step over, step back in. That's all it is. If you're modifying, step, tap, tap, step, tap, tap. Okay, just step it out. Don't do the hop. Four, three, two, let's go. Step, step, step. Step, step. Step, step. Over tap. That's it. Ten seconds. Two, one, and rest. Okay, march it out. Left, right. Round number three, coming at you in four, three, two, one. Let's go, quick feet to the cone, step over and back in. If you're modifying, march, 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 over. Okay, just slow it down, still keep moving quickly. Seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. You've got one more round through this one. Whew. Step it out, let's go. Left, right, left, right. Last round, four, three, two, one. Quick feet, go boom, 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 over. seconds, come on. Five, four, two, one, rest. Okay, grab some water and a big deep breath. We've got one more exercise to go, guys. Whew. Move your cones out almost to the end. Or your markers, whatever you have there. Twenty seconds, and we're starting on our last round. Okay. Here's your move. One eighty jumps. Okay. Start out facing this cone. You're jumping. Face other cone. Tap. Other cone. Tap. If you're modifying, I want you to step, tap, step back, tap, step back, tap. Okay. Start in the squat, or half squat, and let's go. Over. Touch. Over. Touch. Like I said, if you're modifying, step backwards and forwards, then squat down and tap. Ten seconds. That's it. And rest. Whew. Step it out. Boom. Boom. One down. Starting on round number two in ten seconds. We got it. Whew. Here we go. In four, three, two, one. Tap down. Tap, turn. Use your arms to help you get up and over. Slow it down if you need to. If this is bothering you, step, squat, step, squat, okay? Huh. Ten seconds. Step and step. Round number three coming at you. 
In five, four, three, two, one. Let's go. Tap. Yes, I know it's burning. Me too. 15 seconds. And soft. Seven. Six. Five. Three. Two. One. Oh my gosh. Ouch. Okay. One more round. Let's step it out. It's all mental at this point, guys. Everything's hurting. You're totally out of breath. You're tired. We've got this. Two, one, let's go. Tap, turn, tap, turn. However you're turning, get there. Whew, last round. Give me all you got. Whew, 15 seconds. Don't stop yet. Not yet. Almost. Nine, eight, seven. Come on. Go, go, go. Two, one. And rest. <sighs> Woo! Okay, big deep breath. <sighs> Breathe. And I want you to have a seat on your mat. And now you're gonna hop across the mat with just your butt. I'm just kidding. We're done. <laughs> All right, bring your feet in together. We are gonna cool it down, guys. You did a great job. That was not an easy workout. If you were here right now, more than likely you're covered in sweat with me, right? But I do appreciate you being here. I appreciate you making yourself a priority today. Whatever obstacles were in your way, you are here, you made it. Take that arm, reach up and over. Still making sure to keep your chest up tall so you can catch your breath. Great job. Switch hands, reach up, arch over when you can. Still focusing on the breathing. Amazing job, guys. Before you head out, if you don't have time for the cool down today, make sure you do it later, first of all. Cool down is just as important as your warm up. And according to, in, you know, in reference to getting back on track tomorrow, you don't want to be sore. Okay, you want to cool these muscles down the right way. Come on over onto your stomach. So if you're heading out now, make sure you cool down later. Before you head out, definitely make sure to click subscribe. If you have a friend that you think might love this workout, someone who is maybe athletic, someone who used to be an athlete like me, a has-been, I guess they call it now, <laughs> make sure to give them this workout, check it out. Or if someone's just looking for a different form of cardio, you know, running alone can get kind of boring sometimes. Okay, sit back, butt onto your calves. So if you know a friend who's getting in shape for summer, working on a bikini body, working on a beach bod, and looking for a way to slim down, definitely share this workout with them. Come on up, hips up to the ceiling. Keep breathing. Hamstrings here. Slowly come on back up. Okay, let's really stretch the calves out here, right? Kick one leg back behind you. Make sure your legs are about hip width apart so they're not directly behind each other. And drop that back heel down onto the ground. And make sure when you get there, lean forward, keeping it down. And you can bend it a little bit. And straighten. Bend. Straighten. And if you are sore in your calves over the next couple days, I suggest finding um, like a stair or a wall and propping your toe up against it and kind of leaning forward into it like this. Okay. Kick it back straight. And bend that leg. All right. Let's take it out. Cross one leg way over the other. And reach down in front. So I'm working on the side glute here. Get that one leg out front. Or if you're here, same thing. I'm gonna feel it on the side. Cross it over. And roll it up. 
up slowly. Let's circle the arms. Alternate between forward and backwards. Make sure you fuel your body after this, guys. You just probably totally depleted all your glycogen stores, okay? Make sure you refuel with the right things, okay? No processed foods, no high sugar foods, right? Get you a clean, lean meal after this. If you need help with your nutrition, I've got you there as well. Head over to my website in the video or in the description below this video. I've got a 30 day transformation program that's gonna teach you how to eat what you need to eat for your body type and your lifestyle, okay? So if you're not really sure what to eat, how to eat for your body and your life, check that out. I've got promos going on right now, 50% off of that program and off my apparel. Just to thank you guys for helping me grow this community and I can't wait to keep growing with you. Make sure before you head out, click thumbs up if you liked it, comment, let me know what you thought. And of course, always, when you're done with this video, make sure you click subscribe because I would love for you to keep joining me for these workouts and help our community continue to grow. All right, guys, I can't wait to see you tomorrow. Have an awesome day today.